Okay, today we will be doing a toe-down of this ViewSonic LCD display. Um, this is episode 2 of Graphite Labs, Inc. What's Inside series. Um, just to be clear, we are unrelated to the Graphite Labs indie game dev company. So uh, let's get right into it. Okay, we have the back cover off. That took a long time. Um... So, underneath this shield is the housing. Um, we will get to that later. But first, um, we flip this up and here are the speakers. Right here. Speaker one, speaker two. Um, the motherboard's in here, like I said. This says do not touch on it. Um, basically what this is, is this, this still works, so I'm going to put it back together and use it, because I don't have anything broken, and I'm broke all the time, so if I'm broke, I can't do anything, any money, so I'm going to take these pieces off, um, we will be able to get underneath into this board. The rest is tape off. Alright, so we have the tape off. Um, now, under here, hold on. So I'm gonna unplug this wire. Oh, it's connected to this, duh. Um,. So, yeah, let me unplug this. So, right here, and I'll be right back. So, let's just say I did what I had to to get this undone. I'm 90% sure this won't go back together. I got this at a garage sale for free. This monitor was free, just to be clear, so I didn't ruin anything new. Um, I got the cord off, though, that's what matters. So, underneath... We have two boards, um, this board, and this board, um, one of these is main, but I'm not sure which one, this is the motherboard, so, we have four screws, one, two, three, I guess we only have three, huh, and over here we have two screws, so, one, two, now, just to be clear, this board right here, this one is the power intake. So this takes in the power, and you can usually tell because it'll have more solder. In this case, it's clear because um, if I can get this over, this is the power intake, and this is the power board, and there's this wire. Um, and over here you have the sockets, VGA, HDMI, and then these three, or these two, I don't know what those are called, I hate those. So, if you wanted, you could probably change these out. So, if I did break this, I'm totally gonna keep this board, because I can put it on other boards, but you get, you get the point. Um, so, the power one, not very interesting, I'll still get to it, nonetheless, but with this one... Um, there's two screws holding it in. I got one of the screws. So these work very differently from those. Okay, so we have our screws out. Um, and I'll get the board in a second. Something I, something I thought was important to note, if someone's doing, using this as a tutorial, is these on the VGA, where you screw the cable into, count as screws. So, that's what I'm working on right now, and I can't seem to find anything to take it out. Okay, so I got the board out 
finally, that took forever. Um, now you can see this cable right here. Um, it's hard to see because the lighting is so bad. But this is red and black and this is white and black. Um, those are the speaker cables. They go here. Um, this is the cable. This is like, this goes outside and connects to this giant panel. And this is what shows the display. But, and we'll get to that in a second. Um, and then you've got like all your little transformers, I think. Are those crystals? I don't think they're crystals. I think they're capacitors. Anyways, you got those, um, and then you've got this big cable, well, big, leading to the power board, which we'll get to in a second as well. So I pulled the board out, um, and this is the board, this is the power board, um, you have this giant capacitor here, um, you have the power inlet, obviously, it's just a standard cable for monitors, um, you have more capacitors, these ones are much smaller, um, a transformer, I don't know what this is, I think it's transformer, it looks like a transformer, it's the type that's in microwaves, um, this is a capacitor, 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 I think these are all capacitors, um, and then you have these things, I always forget what they're called, I think it's a transistor, um, and then a heat sink, and a relay, I think it's a relay. Um, this is a diode, if you guys are wondering. I just like to name these. Another diode. A diode. At, next to this thing, this is a transistor. This is a diode. Heat sink, and then I think it's a ROM. Um, so, that's that. And over here at this, we have um, the control panel. There's nothing interesting on this. It's literally just buttons. And then this um, ribbon cable to control power and crap. Um, then you have this cable, which is essentially pointless. I could cut this off and it wouldn't matter. I don't think. Again, I'm not the most smart. And then this is like the big board to make sure that it's like the power and everything for this giant LCD display. And the way these work are, there's a layer, one with a liquid crystal display, that's what it stands for, those are glass. Um, and then there's a couple sheets of like light diffusers and crap like that, and then an LED board. And that's how they work, it's pretty simple. Much more simple than an electron gun. Um, yeah, so that will probably be it. So I'll see you guys in the next video. So I'll see you guys later.